Hello everybody and welcome back to part 14 of this Fallout New Vegas walkthrough. So this time, like I said, we're going to carry off with the second DLC of the four. We're going to go through Honest Hearts. We're starting that one today. But first off, I'm going to go... I roll her sweet. I'm going to go up to the penthouse and... I forgot her name. Jane. Sell her that bobblehead. I bet those boomers have some awfully big guns. Y'all are keeping track of me, okay. Got a snow globe. You do? Why, that's just wonderful. I'll take it and put it with the rest of the collection. Okay, that's all I needed. So, let's go Be back down to the four. casino. Casino. Casino floor. So, where, where do we got to head to? I already highlighted the quest. Happy Trail. Find the Happy Trails Caravan Master. So we're going... Oh, just right up here. Okay, let me exit here. And I'll just fast travel to... Where's that place? Mole Rat Ranch, I think. On the outside? Yeah, that works. Y'all aren't aggro anymore because I killed that Brahmin. Oh. Walk right this way. So I already dis... I... I dismissed Veronica to the Lucky 38. And I went and picked up Boone in between some quests. In between uh, the last last part in this. And I assume since they don't let usually let companions come on DLCs, I dismiss Boone as well. So, they're all chilling at the Lucky 38. After we finished out Honest Hearts... Um, we're gonna obviously go back to doing another, uh, faction subline, or subquest. So we're probably gonna go do the White Glove Society. But before we even start on that, after we finished Honest Hearts, I'm gonna go, uh, I was doing a little research on some of the companions. I'm gonna go pick up Rex. So I already did the Qu King's quest line, so I should be able to, uh, ask about Rex and be able to get him as a companion. He looks pretty fun. I mean, it's, it's a dog. Cybernetic dog. That's freaking awesome. So, finish through Honest Hearts. We'll start off with that. There's no uh, waypoints at all over here. Is there just nothing over here? Yeah. I don't want to do like every every little subquest I can find or every mission I can find but I do want to uh I do want to get like the main factions visit the NCR talk to the legion everybody where is this at oh up here I don't think I can go in that building I want to visit the main ones though all the factions that they give except for the uh omertas because I'm not filming Gamora I'm not filming that place. It's just not gonna happen. Nice. Well, make a save before we go in here. Yeah, but I'll do everyone but the Gamora. Howdy, friend. Heard my little broadcast, did you? Yeah. You look the type. Tell me more about this job. The job is simple. Help us get this caravan in design and find new Canaan. The pay is 25 caps per day. Half up front, half on return. You'll get a bonus if we make it in design. Plus another bonus if we reach new Canaan. Oh, uh, one more thing. Don't mention the name Joshua Graham to anyone. Anyone. Yeah, who is Joshua Graham and why shouldn't I talk about him? Just don't. It makes the new Canaanites powerful uncomfortable, and it scares the britches off the tribals. Don't talk about the burn man either while you're at it. Trust me on this one. It's for your own good. What can you tell, tell me about the area? Well, I ain't never been inside myself. Did some trading with the new Canaanites from their mission there, but that was all on the outskirts. All the old ways in and out were destroyed after the war. But we got ourselves the location of a pass the new Canaanites use. That's our way in. 
That's why I wanted someone with a pit boy on the caravan. The map will be helpful for checking the topography, keeping us on the trail. What's the situation like in Utah? Well, it ain't good, I tell you that. It's not like the Mojave or the NCR. Hell, even Arizona under Caesar is safer. You got raiders all over the damn place. Tribes of degenerates that'll eat you as soon as look at you. Regional warlords, the works. Not too many decent places to stop and trade. New Canaan's one of the only ones left I know about. Tell me about the raiders. They're about what you'd expect. Crazy. Jacked up on Kim's, violent as hell, and not too bright. The worst of the 80s. But we won't be passing through their turf on this run. Had some other True. questions. Tell me about the Happy Trails Caravan Company. We're a smaller company out of Sacktown, up in the northern part of the NCR. Sacramento? We run some business through New Reno. They're on the little loop. Had a nice run to Salt Lake City, too, but uh, then we lost contact with New Canaan, and that went all to hell. You ain't wrong. Losing the Salt Lake City run really stung us. If we can't reestablish contact with this run, We'll be in real trouble. Shoot. Don't know much about the place, but I can tell you about the people. The new Canaanites were some kind of religious group from before the war. They control the old city of Ogden, a ways north of Zion, and they got themselves a nice defensible mission in the canyon itself. Or they did. They trade a fair bit with the tribes in Zion. Well, the ones that don't try to kill them anyways. Okay, I'm ready to go to Zion. I bet you are. But you ain't going nowhere loaded down like a pack Brahmin. Nice <laughs> strong back. Huh. I do believe you could. Why the weight limit? You ain't never been to Zion, have you? We'll be passing through a whole mess of narrow slot canyons and high rough passes. A big pack will get you wedged in like a super mutant crawling through a storm drain. And too much weight will kill you in the thin air. Yeah. Okay, can I store them anywhere? Can I put it in a shipping crate or do I have to go outside? What does the quest say? What do I need to be? 100 pounds or less. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do this the simple way since I have this fast travel point now. Yeah, Northern Passage. I'm going to just go back to the strip and uh, unload some stuff in my chest safely. Because I have... I'll, I'll keep mainly the guns that I have like several thousand rounds of. Like I have 1,300 rounds of 357 Magnum, so I'll keep the police pistol. And I have, I'll probably drop the 5.56, five, so maybe I'll, maybe I'll hold on to the Rat Slayer. Hey, if you've been able to bug Mr. House's network Leave yet? me alone. Yeah, I got a quest from the followers of the Apocalypse to bug Mr. House's, I guess, one of his systems so I can, they can see what's uh, keeping him Wait, alive. I want to see the technology that's kept him alive for so long, but I couldn't care less. Let's drop some of these. I might hold on to the Rat Slayer. Put away 10 mil pistol. Uh, we'll get rid of that gun. Sturdy Caravan. Silence 22. I kind of want to keep the Rat Slayer. We'll see how much weight I have. I don't think I'm going to be able to carry all this stuff. So... I want to keep the hunting shotgun and police pistol because those are a lot of a lot of uh, ammo. So I'll put away the rat slayer. I didn't really want to. Actually, assault carbine weighs more. I think I probably have to get rid of both of them. What else do I have that can lower weights? I have 29 pounds of doctor's bags. Let me see if I can put those somewhere. There's another chest right here. I want to keep all my storable stuff in the same area, so... 
I'm not gonna run away without it. So let me keep... I want to keep all my stim packs super... Everything that doesn't weigh. Like wine and whiskey. Weapon repair kit. I need more of those. I only have four of them. That's sad. Stealth boy. Let me put ten away. I'll keep three on me. Scotch. Purified water. I'm gonna... Eh. I have plenty of stimpaks, don't I? 47, 14. Yeah, I'll put the purified water away. I'll just drink that right now. So I can get the cap out of it. Junk food. Put that all away. Healing powder. I'll come back for it all. Oh, guns and bullets. That's just a book. I'm going to use that right away. Grilled mantis. Let me put like 20 of these away. That's 20 pounds right there. Actually, just lower that down to... Let's put four... Let's keep five on me. I want to keep... Uh, do I want to? Energy res resist and fire resist. Put those away. Was there any drinks I missed? Okay, so I need to... Aid. I still have the rebreather on. I'm gonna hold on to that anyways. So guns and bullets, where's that at? That's just a book, I need that. Nuka Cola. So I can get the cap. Do I have any Sunset Sarsaparillas? Nope. Okay, how much do I weigh now? 99. What do I have for weapons? I still have the Assault assault Carbine for 5 mil ammo. I'm probably going to go ahead and put that away. So I got... The weapons I got... I'm going to keep Shovel. There's probably Graves somewhere. Hold on to it. 3 pounds. Police Pistol, 357 Magnum. Hunting Shotgun, 12 gauge. And the Sleepy Time Silent uh, Submachine Gun. Okay. Uh, oh, I mean, I can carry seven more pounds. What weighs less than that? I can't... I could bring... Why is service rifle weigh eight and a half pounds and a snipe... I guess Riot Slayer is not very big. What else can I bring? What, what else do I want to bring? What will I actually use? I'd use something like the medicine stick, but I don't have enough ammo for that. Let me bring... Maybe I'll keep the assault carbine on me. I'll be under 100 pounds. And I'll have some sort of rifle. Okay. Sweet. Come on, Victor. Back to the casino. Let's get through this uh, Happy Trails floor. caravan. Took a little detour there. Northern Passage. Let's go. Let's actually start this DLC. I'm under 100 pounds, so... I couldn't imagine not being, like, only being limited to 50. Thank God I, I have strong back. Enjoyed me a while longer. Are we ready? Let's go. Are you now? I don't want no... You sure you... I'm sure. Well, all right then. Let's get moving. We got a long road ahead of us. The paths we're following are slow going, so you might as well keep your ears open. And listen to what old Jed has to say. A few decades back, folks in the NCR started to hear about a community in northern Utah called New Canaan. Didn't know much about them, except that they were religious folks, sent out missionaries to talk to the tribes. We've seen our share of cults, but the New Canaanites? They were honest traders. Good fighters, too. Raiders wouldn't tangle with them. But then... The Legion appeared in Arizona. 
I reckon you know all about them. Turns out Caesar's first war chief, the Malpace Legate, was a new Canaanite, Joshua Graham. Legend goes that Graham was the meanest, toughest son of a bitch in the whole damn legion. The new Canaanites wouldn't talk about him. They were ashamed. Guess I can't blame them. Well, at Hoover Dam, the Malpace Legate finally met his match. Hanlon and Oliver kicked his new Canaanite butt right back over the river. Caesar had to make an example for the others, to show them that even at the highest level, failure wouldn't be tolerated. He had Graham covered in pitch, lit on fire, and thrown into the Grand Canyon. People say he didn't even scream on the way down. Not long after, some of the slaves and tribals started to talk, said Graham wasn't dead. Shouldn't have been any surprise. All this talk bothered Caesar. So he forbade anyone from speaking his name. Wanted to erase Joshua Graham from history. He got his wish. Joshua Graham disappeared. And in his place came legends of the burned man walking the wastes. Probably just a tribal ghost story. But New Canaan's been silent for a long time. Maybe it's a coincidence. Maybe the Malpace Legate is dead. Or maybe Joshua Graham did crawl out of that canyon and finally found his way back home. All right, people. Been a long couple of weeks, but here we are. Zion. I know your feet hurt. I know you're tired, but I need everyone's mind on the trail ahead. Ain't the trail ahead worries me, Jed. Those descents we made through that slot canyon back up there. Ain't no way we're getting back out the way we come. And then what? God damn it, Stella heard you the first time. And the 15th, too. The new Canaanites will know a way. And if they don't, we've got the maps on our friend's Pip-Boy over there. Enough lollygagging. Get moving. And keep an eye out for tribals. Sorry to bother you with reality. Let me make sure I got the right weapons on. Um, yeah, I'll keep the police pistol on for now. Well, Jed, who cares if we can't get back out the way we come? That's not a problem. Because I'm following Jed. Shh. Hold on now. Could swear I heard something up ahead. Yep, yep, yep. Hold up. God damn it! Ambush! Cover people! Watch yourselves! I don't deserve this! Where the heck are they coming from? Did I hit him? Where y'all at? Oh. Dang it. I'm trying to... I don't even think I could really prevent that. It said optional to beat the white legs assault, but they all got wiped out way too quickly for me to be able to even prevent this. What what doesn't weigh anything? I'll take that stuff. Uh, I'm sorry, guys. Y'all got wiped out, though. Like, very sadly. Ooh. Well, I can get my weight back above 100 now, since... I think that was only really for uh, starting the mission, so I'll take all this stuff. Dang, I got plenty of ammo. Patriot's cookbook. Okay, I'm gonna loot all y'all. Recharge your pistol, okay. I'll just take everything. There's going to be a vendor around here somewhere. Hunting rifle, leather armor. Oh, 
Oh, that's already maxed out. Okay. Anything else? Okay, let's go. Yeah, y'all got freaking wrecked by these guys. What are white legs? White legs storm drummer. Ooh, I saw that in the uh, little promo there. Those look freaking cool. Look like a Thompson submachine gun. Is there anybody else to loot? Get wrecked. Get absolutely wrecked. This is why... This is why I brought the police pistol. Because it's actually just really good. So I got sledgehammer. Let me repair these. So which one's... Why does one actually do more damage? Okay. 45 auto. I'll take all the ammo I can get for that. It's a Thompson. It's freaking awesome. It's one of my favorite, like, just actually looking guns. Let me actually... Does it actually only take one... Oh. You took him out. I was about to say, it only took one shot for that. Hoy. White legs don't leave survivors often. You're some kind of lucky, let me tell you. Or skilled. You came from outside, didn't you? From the civilized lands. Wow. Joshua will want to hear about this. I mean the lands beyond the valley. The place where the cities never fell. Where people don't live in tribes and forage just to survive. No, they still do that. Joshua keeps saying it isn't paradise out there. But how can it not be? Compared to this? I mean, Y'all got a better view. Sorry. I'm getting distracted. Joshua will want to know about you. Please, go to our camp on the Eastern Virgin. Tell him how you came to be here. Good sists? Yeah. Maybe while you're there, you can tell me about where you came from. Yeah. Oh, is he following me now? You can you can come with me. Let me just loot this guy. He might have I think he has another submachine gun, so I'm going to loot him. Nope. Oh, it's 9 mil. Ooh, 9 mil submachine gun. Okay. Hold up. See that log over there? Take a closer look. This log? There might be some good stuff tucked in there. Okay. Nice. So I'm about to keep an eye out for logs as well throughout this whole thing. They got loot in them. There's a reason I had to take the carry carry weight perk because I'm a loot rat. Follow this path for a while. Nice view of the river. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Y'all got. There's still raiders. Please. What the heck was that? Don't. I'm gonna kill you. Come at me. Yagwai. Run at me, dog. You're going down. If I could actually hit my shots at all. Giant Yagwai. I'm not passing up the opportunity to kill that thing. You joking? There's a spot over there, but I'm gonna loot these Yagwai. Is it just a giant bear? I mean, yeah, it looks like a giant bear. I'm gonna try to pick up some of the uh, waypoints here. Oh, there's plenty of them over here.
I don't want to jump off and like not be able to get back up here. So I'll move on to a different waypoint. Is there one up here? It's probably up top, isn't it? Can I pick it up from down here? Keep headed north around this rock pile. I just want to know if I can pick up that waypoint. That's probably on top of the rocks, and I don't know how to get up there just yet, but we'll keep moving on. Oh, look at that. Oh, nice. Roads. You love to see it. Follow the old road south. Nearly there. Well, I want to see if I can... If there's a waypoint up top. Let me see if I can access it from here. I know I'm getting distracted. Real bad problem with me. Is that another Yaguai? Yaguai cub. Well, I think I killed your mom. I'm sorry, man. Yeah, I just want to pick up some points. The spine. It is a hollow log. Look at that. Okay. Cl Put away my pistol so I can move a little quicker. Yeah, I'm kind of wrecking the wildlife already. I've been here for like, what, 15 minutes now? <laughs> I'm wrecking, wrecking all the wildlife already. Maybe I shouldn't have come to, uh, come with this caravan. We're in Utah now, right? Mount Zion. So, maybe I shouldn't have come. Give me more uh, white leg enemies with those uh, 45 auto Thompson sub machine guns. I want those at forever. I'm not going to drop down to get a waypoint, so. Keep going up. Well, there's a. I know there's a waypoint now there, at least. At that bus. I guess that crashed off the cliff. What's aggroed? What is that? You see the dead oh, is that ants? Shamans say our only souls are killing them. But Joshua says it shows we're serious about fighting white legs. Little baby rad scorpion. See those handprints? Dead horses and sorrows mark them on taboo places. Places from back when. Good thing for you, I don't buy into that stuff. Oh, cool. Well, wait, is that is that a good sunset pass for? No, empty. Okay. Let's keep going around the side. Oh, getting stuck. I'm happy to travel with you, but you're not headed toward the dead horses anymore. Oh, is this not? Where do I go? Must be down here. Down this path to the north. Hope you don't mind getting wet. Wait, okay. I, I guess I wasn't paying attention to what direction we had to go. I guess the big tribal painting might <laughs> might be an indication. Show the dead horses' victories against other tribes. Lots more of them since Joshua came to us. Yeah, if he's the big bad of uh, oh. nearly there now. Watch out for traps in the water. Got to keep the white legs out somehow. Eh? If he was the... 
well, secondary big bad before he got betrayed because he couldn't win the first battle of Hoover Dam, then he's probably a pretty good fighter and a pretty good leader, so makes sense he's leading them to victory. I want to meet Joshua Graham, though. Is that a spear? Throwing spear, okay. I, don't e I think I have the perk now. I don't even set these off. Yeah, I forgot. I don't know why I keep on avoiding them, though. I always forget I have it. Here we are. Joshua's just ahead there in the angel cave. Y'all hunt for fish? Dead horses camp. Two bears high fiving. That is an amazing name. Two bears high fiving. Follows chalk. And two bears high-fiving. I love it. Make a save. Hoi. Auslander Zuka Joshua Graham. Sorry, I don't understand you. Auslander Utman Zuka Joshua Graham. You look for Joshua Graham. Yes, I'm looking for him. Is he here? He in high place of cave. You show respect, Auslander. Joshua is greatest warrior. You show him no respect. He show you thunder and fire. Yeah, thanks for that. Ha ha. Funny, Auslander. Maybe soon dead, Auslander. I doubt it. I'm a pretty good fighter. That's why I'm going to take out Caesar's Legion, the NTR. I'm going to take it out of everybody. I'm on my own. We should have given you a better welcome on your first visit to Zion. But from what I hear, the White Legs beat us to it. White Legs seem to be the only visitors we have these days. And I wouldn't have expected anyone from the Mojave to come looking for us. And you're a courier, no less. Not the one I was expecting, but I suppose he wouldn't have come with a caravan. I don't know if you were close to the other members of your group, but you have my sympathy. I pray for the safety of all good people who come to Zion, even Gentiles. But we can't expect God to do all the work. Happy trails. I remember. They were good friends. I have bad news for your employers. New Canaan was destroyed, its citizens scattered. All because of the White Legs. And Caesar, of course. The White Legs want to join the Legion. Caesar's rite of passage is the destruction of the New Canaanites. Almost assuredly because of me. So you did survive. The good news is that we can help you find your way back. Daniel, one of the other New Canaanites, has made many maps of the region. The bad news is that we can't help you right now. Not with everything that's going on. I'm not going to leave without offering help. What can I do? You're a good neighbor to us. We all go through periods of darkness. In such times, we can turn to the Lord. But it's good to have friends. Daniel and I need pre-war tools to help us navigate beyond Zion. Should we need to evacuate, these instruments will be vital to us. Normally, we would have some of the dead horses or sorrows look for them. But many pre-war buildings in the valley are taboo. They won't go inside. Taboo? The sorrows believe in a spirit that lives in the caves. Say the spirit punished them once for trespassing. They put special marks around the cave entrances to keep people out. It doesn't work on the white legs, of course. But the dead horses are spooked. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Follows Chalk can help you find your way around the valley. He's inexperienced, but he knows enough of our language to ignore the taboos about pre-war buildings. Got it.
Gone fishing. See, I'm not dead, lady. Whichever one you are. Okay, where do exactly we, do we have to go? Oh, the crash scout bus. Okay. Why y'all fighting? Okay. Don't know why y'all are fighting. So is it... Yeah, just follow this way out. And then follow the river around to that bus. Ah, the eastern virgin. What's the phrase of how sweet house? Nope, home sweet home. Close enough, though. It's the thought that counts. I see a red marker. Where's that at? Is that up there? Okay, I don't think I can get to him. Jumping in water does not sound very, very good. I'm probably going to stop that. Okay. So, just follow my way up around here. And I did it again. Give me some more white legs to fight. Come on now. I want some enemies. I need to find a different action-packed uh, DLC. Maybe your Old World Blues will be more action-packed. But so far I'm liking this one. They got me some better guns to get at least. That's a big thing for me. More guns to shoot. And freaking Joshua Graham looks like a straight up... Oh! Oh, that was just you jumping in water. I thought somebody was shooting at me. But Joshua Graham looks like a straight up badass. I hope that story is true of him. Uh, I mean, we know he got covered in pitch and set on fire. But I hope he didn't scream. Because that'd be so freaking cool. I mean, it's a horrible thing to happen to anybody. But Jesus. Can I actually hit a shot? Okay, just got stuck in place there. Are you fighting somebody? Why are you, like, groaning? Like you're in a fight. See this? This is why your own two feet are better than any cart. Whether it's pulled by critters or goes on its own. Hey, dino toy. Why am I... I don't know why I'm picking up lunchboxes. I can repair that. Take compass sensor module. That might have been the part I could repair uh, that broken compass with if I didn't have the repair skill, but I do. Is that another suitcase? Empty. I'm just going to pick up all the lunch boxes. Why not? Okay, where else do I have to go? Nope. Okay, just keep following the river. Looks like you'd cross over here, but that looks like a broken bridge. I don't think you can cross there. Let's see. <laughs> now it's intact. Okay. Let me discover that waypoint then. Look sharp. Lots of giant ants around here. We call them picnic killers. What the heck are you? We really know what that means. 
Something from back when, I guess. Are you okay, my guy? There must be enemies around here if you're sneaking like that. Is there anything in the back of this? Whoa! Here we go! Oh. Gotcha! Oh, it's a rad scorpion. I thought it was a freaking uh, white leg. Come on, man. You're scaring me for no reason. It's a bloat fly. Actually hit shots. Thank God I have 1,300 rounds. <laughs> so even if I miss most of them. Fighting time. Eventually I'll hit one. Here we go. Just eventually. Oh, what the heck? Time. Freak it. Is that a mantis? Zion mantis nymph. Might be something up here to... Waypoint. Ant burrow. I'll take it. This looks like another waypoint for a crashed bus. Is that a white legs? White legs bone breaker. Bladed gauntlet. I'll take it. it. Must have been nice when Zion was friendly enough. Folks could make camp wherever they pleased and not worry about white legs and deadly critters. I mean, probably some of these places are still deadly critters, just not near on the same level as freaking giant ants Fighting and time. mantis. Whatever that thing is. Oh, that's a, that's a big horner. Are y'all aggro on me? Please don't be... Oh, are y'all aggro? Don't try to fight me, please. I don't want to fight some big horners. Yaogwai Cave, okay. You just drop down here into the water. Pick up some of these uh, waypoints. Windwall docks. Oh, freaking Cazadors, man! I hate these guys. I hate Cazadors. Whoever came up with them, I mean, they're smart because they're a horrible enemy, but geez. They suck so much. So that's where we have to go. Get up there. I'm going to go around the back side, I guess. Maybe I can get that last waypoint over here. What is that little thing? Is that a rad scorpion? What was that? I mean, I shot it. Oh, coyote pup. Okay. Jeez. Den mother. Okay. Well, I'm sorry. You're not a bad guy, are you? You're a dead horse warrior. Gotcha. Bet they don't have anything as nasty as Yao Guai about where you come from. Um, I think death claws are a thing that are way worse. I mean, Yao Guais are just even bigger bears that look really fast and are very scary. But death claws are just killing machines. Eventually, I'm gonna go clear out that because above Good Springs, um, I know that there's a death claw infestation over there. I'm definitely gonna clear that out. That's gonna be its own part because that looks like a fun fight. Hopefully, I can get some uh. I probably had to visit like 
what is that place? Vault 34, where you can get... I heard you can get, like, a really nice gun from there. I'll probably have to do something like that before I even start Whoa. this. Here we go. Before I even start this, because... Um, I'm gonna need something good to... Oh, go through the level up here. My speech is at 80, science is at 80. But repair up to 60. Speech up to 85. What else do I need? Yeah, I put lockpick up to 85 as well. I still want to get Adamantium Skeleton. Ooh, Explorer looks really good. I think I'm gonna go with Explorer. I can pick up every location on the map. Nice. So I know where they are. If I need to go get something, I can... Three Marys. Yep, okay. I'm happy with that. Very happy with that perk. Fighting time. Whoa. Here we Is there go. more? Where Young Golden Gecko. Caravan Shotgun. Patriot's Cookbook. Oh, come on. Really? There we go. Walkie talkie. Was that what I needed for him? I wasn't even paying attention. For as long as I remember, the dead horses have thought that places of the old world were taboo. Doesn't look so spooky to me. I mean, it's not. Toolbox, what do you got? Nothing. There is med. Meds, though. More super stim packs. Fishing lodge cabinet key. Okay, so that was the... So I didn't even have to unlock that. Okay. Let me get the Sunset Sarsaparilla and Nuka Cola out of here. So... Do I have anything to repair? Bladed gauntlet. There's also a mantis gauntlet too as well. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Do I have plenty of 9 mil ammo? I'm going to put on the hunting shotgun. Okay, go back to Joshua Graham, I guess. Oh, no, there's more places we have to go, isn't there? General Storage Zion Ranger Station. Okay, let's do it. I have all the locations, though, so I can actually see where it is and what's nearby.
What the heck? Don't scare the crap out of me like that. Let me get a little closer to you. Problem with the shotgun. Okay, why would I equip this weapon? If I know I'm going to be at range for most of these people. That's my own fault. Let me, uh... What do you have? Trail carbine. Okay. Oh, he just took out that... I hit one of these shots. There, no, come on. I didn't even... Did one of those white legs survive? Oh, jeez. That's a big drop, isn't it? Okay. I have to find a different way around here. I'm sorry, dead horse, dude. Okay, well, we're gonna make the drop. And that was a mistake. That was a very big mistake. Well, that's what I get. Yep. Go back to the exit here. Well, I'll keep the... I know it's there this time, so I'm gonna keep out the police pistol. <laughs> okay. That's my fault. Well, I know there's going to be enemies, so I'll keep full health after I wreck this dude. Yeah, I see you. Okay, has to be a way down over here. Anybody? Way down. I'd appreciate it. Are they all big drops? They're all freaking big drops. Dang it. Oh, over here. Oh, you have a bladed gauntlet. I need to start shooting legs. Because these guys just run at me. I'm not about that. Well, I got purified water. Let me just take some of that stuff. Oh, yeah, I forgot it lowers strength. I need to stop taking those things. Where is it at? I'm going to drop those. I swear to God I will. Drop that. What, else, what did I take that lowered strength? Well, it's my own fault. Now I'm stuck with this stupid slow walk. Get me out of this, please. Stop it. Oh my god. When does it end? The spitter plants and the green monster men aren't native to Zion. 
Wonder where they came from. I don't know, man. I just want to get out of this stupid slow walk. What the heck? When does it stop? I'm not in the mood for a fight right now, man. I'm stuck in this stupid slow animation. Can you take out the dude behind me, please? Because I can't move past a quarter of a mile an hour. I want that fire axe, though. I know that. I Yeah, now I'm legitimately over-encumbered. But I still... I don't even know why I picked these up. These aren't even like something I would ever use. Even the bladed gauntlet. I'm not a melee. I hate melee. Trail carbine. Is that another, uh, Yalgwai cave or what? I don't know. What do y'all got? More white legs or just, uh, mantises or something? Oh, rad scorpion. No, that's ants. Giant worker ants. Oh, got right up on me. Mole rats. We're almost here. Bloat flies. What else is there? There's something around here. Oh, worker ants. Make sure I keep saving. Wow, that's a freaking gigantic mantis. That is insane, man. And there's another one of y'all. Holy. You're in the back room, aren't you? Let me see if there's anything I want here. Sunset sarsaparilla. Nuka cola, Nuka cola. Gotcha. Why'd you open the door, man? Oh. Feels good to be doing some actual scouting. Why would you open the door? They couldn't get out yet, man. That's floating in the air. Is that what I'm here for? Oh! Snow globe. Oh, so that one immediately goes to the... Oh, that, that is what I'm here for. The lunch boxes. Is there another one over here? Oh, this is telling me to go to the door, dummy. So...
like the shadow of a ghost. <laughs> what the heck does that mean? Where's the lunch boxes at? There it is. I mean, there's only one option. I don't know why I'm looking around for something else. There's only one option left. I wasn't paying attention to that part. I'm not going to spend too much time on that. So I think we're done here in this building. Now we got to go to the ranger station. I believe. How do I get up there though? And then maybe back to Joshua Graham. Oh, it's raining. Well, that's freaking cool. I don't know how I find that so cool. But I guess in the apocalypse, rain is pretty cool. Yep, knew it. Do I have medicine 30? I do. Okay, good. Nice. This is a ranger station. Y'all probably have some weapons. 45 pistol. 45 auto pistol. Already got binoculars. Give me some more weapons. Same thing. <laughs> I don't need more alcohol, but... Oh, y'all got firewood. Oh, 4570. Bobby pins. I think that's it in here. I hear some odd things about the civilized lands outside Zion. Is there really a giant thunder lizard people live inside? Giant thunder lizard people live inside. What does that mean? What can I tell you? Let me tell you a story. When I was a boy, a man came through the valley with one of the caravans. Tall man, big mustache, carried a guitar. I asked what he did for his living, and the interpreter told me he was a singer. What is that? I asked. The man explained that he went from place to place and sang for people, who gave him food and shelter and care in return. I couldn't believe that there was a place in this world where a man could do that. I promised myself then that one day I'd explore that world myself. I, um, I haven't told him yet. Never had the Groans. You'd do that? Sure. Sounds smart to me. He might not get so mad at you.
go with Okay. What is our quest looking like now? So let's talk to Daniel. Oh and okay, so I can't talk to Joshua Graham for follows chalk. So I think this is where I'm gonna end uh, the first part of this Honest Hearts DLC. What the heck? The heck is that? Oh, Gecko. I don't think I've seen him spit like that. Okay, well this is where I'm gonna end uh, part one of the Honest Hearts DLC. And I think this is part 14 of this whole playthrough. I've gotten pretty far so far. So next time we're gonna carry on with this deliver supplies to Daniel and the Narrows. And I, next time I get to see Joshua Graham, I'll do that quest. See if I could take him back to the actual uh, Mojave Wasteland. Well, this is where we're going to end it. So I'll see you on the next part. Take care.